I got a new pet last Friday. This is where she likes to hang out. Her name is Hera. She's crazy about me. If I get where she can see me, she wants to get up and... Yeah, yeah say good morning. They put this real cute bow on her at the... Got her from the animal shelter. <clears throat> it's got a bow and it's also got a little bell on it. And they said she didn't mind when they put it on. Now, she'll let you know she minds. I haven't done anything yet that she didn't like. But she had a spit and hissed at Keith. I told Keith. Keith was trying to tell me I wasn't petting her enough. You're supposed to do it like this. Yeah, she said, no, that's too much. She spit and hissed at him. <clears throat> Excuse me. He said, uh, and then, then you stop when she does that. I said, no, I'm not going to do it until she does that. Yeah, I'm, I'm uh, what's the word? Respecting her space. She's been here since Friday, and today is, what day is it, Hera? It's Tuesday morning. She named Hera, H-E-R-A, after a Greek goddess. It was actually the Greek goddess that married Zeus. I think, I don't think Keith knew when he got her for me, but Hera is the goddess of marriage. <laughs> yeah, he's not mentioned marriage, and when I want to, to see him fidget, I, I bring it up. <laughs> but I don't plan to get married. He's just my boyfriend. He bought, he, yeah, well, he bought, he paid the adoption fee, so he as good as bought her for me. And then he spent $25 on food and litter and litter box and a brush. And what else did he get you? I don't know, but I hope those numbers that I'm seeing are not on my picture. That's what she did when they brought her in and put her on the table. <coughs> and had her, had the worker had her hand on Harry's back. And she told me, she said, now, now she, she has some things that she does that might make you not want her, but... But I hope you'll give her a chance, and I hope you'll keep her two weeks and and try. And she said also it might be uh, days, a couple of days for, before she even leaves the carrier that she was giving me to bring her home in. Harris shot out of that thing five seconds. I think Keith's the one that opened it, cause I was scared of her. I saw her, I saw her kiss and spit at that shelter worker. But Eric had got down and gone in a, a empty cage and was trying to use the litter box. And the shelter worker said, oh, no, she, she she shouldn't be in there. And she grabbed her and picked her up. She said, I'm just going to go in and put her back. You've seen her now. And so Harris started spitting and hissing and swinging and trying to bite the woman. And then as they were going out the door, she plopped three plops of poop on the floor. And, and, and so the woman put her up and came out. And she said, I hope that behavior doesn't make you not get her. I said, no, if you'd done that to me when I was doing what she was trying to do, I'd act it the same way. I understand it. So I do like this cat. She's roly poly. She's starting to to lose some of the, the roundness. I should have uh, recorded her when I first got her. She was a little butterball. She has spent over two years in a very small cage at the animal shelter. She'll be 10 years old, February the 3rd. Somebody loved this cat. And I feel like it was somebody who was educated. But anyway, when the worker put her on that table and had her hand on her back, I kind of leaned down and I said, Hey, Hera, you want to go home with me? And she got away from that worker and came to me and just nudged me with her head like she loved me so much. The worker said, I've never seen her act that way over anybody. And then when she, uh, <clears throat> I don't know what's in my throat this morning. I'm sorry I keep doing that. When she, uh, Kissed and spit and tried, tried to bite that worker for making her get out of the litter box when she was trying to use it. I told Keith, I said, well, she has the personality of my pet because uh, Joy was always a, a little, everybody around here was a little bit scared of Joy. But I think Joy was just trying to be friends. She didn't, she didn't bite Sharon. Sharon said she did, but she just chased, chased Sharon around.